Ever wondered why people pause when they walk past some houses while others barely get a glance? The secret lies in the power of first impressions, and today, we're going to show you how to make your home the talk of the neighborhood. Curb appeal isn't just about aesthetics. It's a key factor in increasing your property value and creating a positive impression that lasts. We have five easy steps to transform your home's exterior, each one simpler than you'd think. Ready to turn your home into a head-turner? Let's dive into our first step. Step 1 to instant curb appeal, a fresh coat of paint. It's amazing what this simple upgrade can do for your home. Think about it. When you walk down a neighborhood, what's the first thing you notice about a home? Often, it's the color. A fresh coat of paint can transform a drab, outdated exterior into a home that turns heads. And it's not just about aesthetics. A quality paint job can protect your home against weather damage and increase its value. It's a win-win situation. Now let's talk about choosing the right color. When it comes to painting your home's exterior, you want a color that complements your home's architectural style and the surrounding landscape. If you live in a classic Victorian home nestled among lush greenery, you might want to consider traditional colors like whites, grays, or pastels. On the other hand, if you're in a modern home in a desert environment, bold colors like reds, oranges, or earth tones could be a great fit. But remember, choosing a color isn't just about what you like. It's about what works with your home and its surroundings. Think about your neighborhood's color scheme. You don't want to clash, but you also don't want to blend in too much. It's about striking the perfect balance. And let's not forget about quality. When it comes to paint, you get what you pay for. Investing in high-quality paint means you'll have a longer-lasting, more durable finish that will stand up to the elements. You want a paint job that not only looks great but also protects your home. Finally, don't rush the process. Preparation is key to a successful paint job. This includes cleaning the exterior, making necessary repairs, and priming before painting. A little extra time spent on preparation can make all the difference in the final result. A fresh coat of paint is an instant facelift for your home, but our next step can make an even bigger impact. Step 2 involves playing with Mother Nature. Yes, we're talking about landscaping. Landscaping, folks, is more than just a hobby for green thumbs. It's an art form, a way to express your home's personality, and a powerful tool for enhancing curb appeal. When done correctly, it can transform your property into a captivating oasis that makes passers-by do a double-take. The first thing that meets the eye is the lawn. A well-manicured lawn is the green carpet that welcomes visitors to your home. It's the stage where your house stands and it needs to be in top shape. Regular mowing and watering are the basics, but don't stop there. Aerate your lawn to allow the roots to breathe and fertilize it to provide essential nutrients. Now let's add some color. Planting colorful flowers is like adding jewelry to an elegant outfit. They catch the eye, evoke emotions, and can even reflect the changing seasons. Consider planting them in clusters for a burst of color or create a gradient effect with varying hues. Remember flowers are not just for the garden bed. Window boxes, hanging baskets, and container gardens can all add a touch of floral magic. But landscaping isn't all about the small things. The thoughtful placement of trees and shrubs can dramatically change the look and feel of your property. They can provide shade, create privacy, and even act as windbreakers. Choose species that complement your home's architecture and thrive in your local climate. And of course, don't forget about the hardscaping. Walkways, patios, and retaining walls can all contribute to the overall aesthetic. They create structure, add functionality, and can even guide visitors around your property. In the end, remember that landscaping is about creating a harmonious balance between the natural and built environment. It's about enhancing your home's beauty while respecting Mother Nature's design. With your landscape in bloom, it's time to light it up. Step 3 is all about the right lighting. A well-lit home is a welcoming home. Lighting, it's one of those things that can either make or break your home's curb appeal. It's like the jewelry of a house, adding that sparkle and shine that catches the eye and draws you in. And just like jewelry, it's all about finding the right pieces and placing them in the right spots. Think of the front path to your home. What could be more inviting than a well-lit pathway that guides visitors right to your front door? It's not just about aesthetics, though. Safety is a key factor here. Well-placed lights can prevent trips and falls, making your home welcoming and safe at the same time. Now let's talk about the front door. This is arguably the most important area to light up. It's the main entrance, the focal point of your home's exterior. A well-lit front door not only welcomes guests but also deters potential intruders. Consider wall lanterns or pendant lights on either side of the door or even a single overhead fixture. 
but don't stop at the door. Extend your lighting out into the landscape. Uplighting can accentuate architectural features, while downlighting can create a soft, romantic glow. And of course, there's always the option of spotlighting to highlight a particularly stunning tree or garden feature. Remember, it's not about flooding your home with light. It's about strategic placement to create depth, interest, and safety. It's about using light to accentuate the best features of your home and landscape, and to create a warm, inviting glow that says welcome to everyone who passes by. And one last tip, consider using energy-efficient LED lights. They're not only good for the environment, they can also save you money on your energy bills. Plus, many of them come with smart features like timers and dimmers, giving you even more control over your lighting. Now that your home is shining bright, let's add some finishing touches. Step 4, the finishing touches. These are the details that can make all the difference. There's a saying, God is in the details. And when it comes to curb appeal, it couldn't be more accurate. The little things, the seemingly insignificant can pull everything together and give your home that wow factor. Let's start with something we often overlook, the mailbox. A stylish mailbox isn't just for receiving mail, it's a statement piece, an introduction to your home, so give it a facelift. Replace that old rusty one with something modern, or perhaps vintage if that's your style. Next house numbers. They're not just for guiding your guests or the pizza delivery guy, they're an opportunity to express your style. Consider sleek metallic numbers for a modern look, or intricate hand-painted tiles for a Mediterranean vibe. You have countless options. Just remember, they need to be visible and match the overall style of your home. Finally, let's talk about outdoor art. Now don't worry, we're not suggesting you place a replica of Michelangelo's David on your front lawn. Outdoor art can be as simple as a tasteful sculpture, a wind chime, or a birdhouse. It adds personality and a touch of whimsy to your outdoor space. And there's more. Potted plants, a charming bench, a decorative door knocker, the list goes on. We encourage you to explore to let your creativity run wild. But remember, less is often more. You want to enhance your home, not overwhelm it. These finishing touches might seem trivial, but trust us, they're not. They're what tie everything together, what transform your home from nice to the best on the block. They're the cherry on top, the icing on the cake, the, well, you get the picture. With these finishing touches, your home is now a sight to behold. But we're not done yet. Our final step, step five, is regular maintenance. A well-maintained home is always attractive. It's like a well-polished gem, it shines, it sparkles, and it draws attention. But remember, this isn't just about looking good for one day or even a week. It's about making a lasting impression, a statement that holds true every day of the year. Let's dive into some of the tasks that can keep your home looking its best. Cleaning gutters may not be the most glamorous job, but it's essential. Clogged gutters can lead to water damage, which is neither pretty nor cheap to fix. So, roll up your sleeves and get to it. Your house will thank you. Next, let's talk about windows. They're the eyes to your home and we all know how important clear vision is. Regularly washing your windows can make a world of difference to your home's appearance. It allows more light in, brightens up your living spaces, and gives your home that fresh, clean look. And lastly, consider pressure washing your sidewalks and driveway. It's like giving your home a spa day. It removes the grime and dirt and brings out the true colors of your property. It's a simple task, but the results can be dramatic. With regular maintenance, your home's curb appeal will not just be a one-time wonder, but a lasting impression. And there you have it. Five easy steps to make your home the envy of your neighbors. It's about creating that first impression, freshening up with paint, working some landscaping magic, lighting up your home, adding finishing touches, and of course, regular maintenance. It's all in the details, and the best part is, you can do it yourself. Now it's your turn. Transform your home and share your before and after pictures with us. Don't forget to subscribe for more home improvement tips. Until next time, happy homemaking.